By 1899, the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end. And? America was becoming a land of laws. What? Well, yeah, this is actually true. <laughs> Even the West had been mostly been tamed. I don't know about that. Have you seen some of these West Coast people? A few gangs still roam. A few gangs still roam, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Well, I don't know why I struggle with that. I hate cursor writing. All right. It looks cold. I'm just glad I don't live in the Abigail snow or live dying, anywhere Dutch. it snows. We'll have to stop someplace. Happy goes okay. dying. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. If it's weather, it's May. I'm just it's only May. The got as lost as we did. There, Arthur. Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on. Yeah. An old mining town. Would I rest at a mining town? Uh, yeah, but I'd be, I'd, I'd be spooked out, dude. It's too spooky, man. You ever heard about those ghost stories about the mining camps and whatnot or whatever? Where all the miners died? Not those miners. What happened? Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. Oh no, not Barely. Davy. Who was that Nothing guy again? More you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. In this? <laughs> In this Just weather? Sure. Come on, man. Don't we'll be crazy. see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. Mm-hmm. I loved Davy. Jenny. Jenny? Sean, Mac, they may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, <laughs> in their stead. If I could take I'd their place, I would. But, <laughs> but Never heard that before. We are going to ride out and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. 
Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. Good voice acting. We've got some work to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey. I ain't had time to ask. Me. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. You missed me? Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Yeah, of course. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Bye. We oh, we're going? need you strong. Okay. All right. Let's head out. Ooh, in this in this weather? Find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been yeah. two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. All right. So I completely forgot that I was playing a video game. Like that whole intro cinematic. I'll be down to watch that as a movie. But anyway, terrible damn weather going on. Bridge coming up. Take it easy. Take it easy, he says. <laughs> but as I was saying, uh, I actually witnessed, touched, and seen snow for the first time in my adult life, <laughs> like a couple years ago. It's pretty dope. Ride next to me, son. Don't want to lose you. Can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. Who the hell is Davy? Those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkertons tailing us in this. <laughs> Pinkertons? Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got fire and shelter. That's a start. Let me talk to you. So, do you think it was a trap? In Blackwater? That many men? Oh, they knew we were coming. Mm. But there was money on that boat, all right. Lots of it. I stashed what we took with all our money in town right before we fled. Wait, is that someone coming towards us? Oh, I don't see anybody. How do you see in this weather? Whoa. Hello? Oh, I see that. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Mm. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean. We don't know. Quite a well, he said Chandler business. boys. But one was Jenny, so uh Davy's okay, brother also right, died? Is what I'm assuming? Always ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Him. Okay. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. All right, we're moving up. Passing you. Yeah. Okay. Yo, uh. You run into anybody else? I, I reckon. We're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. Yeah, well, don't talk to me about crazy. Oh, so no, glad you're all right. I was worried, <laughs> Micah. Look, it's all going to work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. 
Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. Ain't much, but shelter. So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders, you know me. Right. Mm. How much further? further? Not far. What does that mean? Not far. Uh, thanks. Right, that's the equivalent of my mom saying, like, are you ready? And he's like, when are we gonna leave? Soon. Oh, when? God damn, this snow Soon. gets right to the bone. All this snow reminds me of a uh, Game of Thrones. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? I think it was the Night Watchers or the Night. Whatever. Let's just continue. How you doing back there? Oh, you're speeding up along. Okay. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those Could you let go, Micah? Best you two lie low on this. Mm, okay. Oh. Okay. W where am I going? What's there. going on? Horse, calm down. Oh, we're getting a tutorial. Let's hitch up here. Okay. Oh, I hear them talking. I hear noises. Whoa. Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. <laughs> Sounds like quite the party. Clearly, you this isn't gonna end well. Sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. Micah, get down behind that wagon in front. Get behind a wagon or something. He don't give a damn about Mike. That's <laughs> well being. Arthur, what are you doing? What are you talking about? I just got here, man. Hello? Shut up, Billy. Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, that might be good. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Huh? What's up? Arthur. Dying. Parker, we got a problem. <laughs> Folks, there's a corpse right here. Oh, that is definitely a problem. Arthur, and I sent that guy in the wagon. I heard you the first time. Keep your eyes on Dutch. I think you should. Now, buddy. Yeah, look out! There's more to back. Can't tell. Any more? We're going, we're going in. Hey, yeah! Execute this motherfucker. Go, 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 go. That's an enemy? Not anymore. Let him run. He ain't gonna make it far. Didn't seem to be going too well. Driscoll boys here? Why? I don't know. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. You know, it got me thinking. Maybe I should have let them talk a little bit longer, but uh, it didn't look good to me. It was a corpse, okay? Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, 
Medicine. Whiskey. <laughs> Whiskey. All right. So one tip that I learned during the Red Dead Online. Oh, I don't have it. I was going to say use your eagle eye. <laughs> it highlights everything. O'Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. What oh, a lovely couple. It's about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Huh. Looks Jake like a poor and Sadie was wedding, too. September 4th, 1896. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Okay. Okay. Just chill, bro. Place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Oh, I'm starving. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. Okay. Oh, biscuits? Oh, hell yeah, give me that shit. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Blood. Actually, there is a blood trail. Grab anything you think we can use, then meet me out here. You leaving? Okay. Oh, it's a medicine cabinet. Yo, you got them pills? What about them uh, gummy vitamins? So many oat cakes. With the classic oat cakes. Oh, look at that. I didn't even notice she up there. How do I even get there? I guess I'm not going to get there. Why am I crashing up? Okay. Uh, is there anything else for me to steal here? Anything. What about this table? Salted meat. Ah, yes. Back in the day, before refrigerators was a thing, people used to put salt in their food to basically preserve it. Whatever, I think we're good here. Ain't nothing here for me. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. The barn? Oh, over there. That barn. Let's open up this bad boy. Of course, it's an ambush. Cousin. I'm gonna break your neck. Punch him, punch him. Mm, mm, mm. Doing the one, two, three. This guy just jumped me. Uh oh, did he now? He's not really fighting back. He's really taking his beat. Stinky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here and where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Talk, damn it. Where's Colm O'Driscoll? Uh, with the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. Any more questions? Or any what more are you answers? Bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. 
But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. Mm. <laughs> Please. Oh, what do I do? Do I? Please spare me. I promise. Nah. Nope. Now we're gonna end you right here. You know why? Because he's told me I shot his cousin. He's gonna definitely come back for revenge. Where's my gun at? Oh, my hat, too. All right. Easy horse. <laughs> if only like taming a horse was this easy in real life come on horse ignore the body there oh it doesn't like that is that bastard still in there he's dealt with good that looks like a decent horse you should keep him you need to hitch him he's already skittish where do I hitch him over here? Get away from me! Uh oh. Micah, what the hell do you think you're doing? What's going on here, Micah? Oh, the guy found in the cellar. Why up there, ain't you? Leave her alone. I wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them O'Driscolls. No, she ain't, Micah. Look at her. Miss, miss. Man, she's rapid right now. Then again, I don't blame her. Now, it is gonna be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss, miss. Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here. It's not gonna be okay. Her, her place Come is on. burning down. Oh. Are you okay, miss? They came three days ago. Then my husband, they... Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. Whew. You come with us. Arthur. Miss, it's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. <laughs> we're bad it's men, okay. but we're not them. <laughs> you know, Sounds like something we'll every bad guy would say. Figure out what you want to do. I'm not bad. That What's guy's even worse. To me? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Oh. Mrs. You... I... He. He was my husband. Damn. Lenny, chill. Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Comb O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Those, uh, those bastards, O'Driscoll. Some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler. This poor Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. I got my own room. Oh, yeah. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Uh, don't be like that, bed. Micah. Mm. 
Ah, the next day. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. Oh, it's not the next day. It's been days. He's strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Uh, Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. <laughs> Arthur's like, you? Abigail, you definitely want something. I need you to... Yep, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. <laughs> we're not worried. The Abigail's situation worried. were reversed. And he'd look for me. Thank you. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Where did you go? Hey, I see some smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, it seems somebody left recently. Recently? And oh, yeah, it is smoking, so yeah. That way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. Ha! Hold. A few hours ago, most. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. Yeah, but that doesn't make sense because John's been missing for two days. This fire just started John? today. You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. Okay, at least Javier has some yeah. sense of so, common sense, I guess. You were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. <laughs> Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way, but it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Hmm. So it was a setup for the ambush. Go left, down here. And Dutch shot an innocent girl. Davy got shot. Mac and John both shot too. Sean, Ooh. we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Okay, but why were we taking so long to Damn get to these snow's guys? coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Seriously, how the hell did John or whoever this person come out here? Watch yourself. It's not very wide here. Also, look at this landscape. It looks beautiful. Come on, boy. Oh, don't fall off, boy. Look at the landscape, man. Horses are struggling. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. 
I don't know about this, Javier. We, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Ah, man. Javier, you're persistent. I'll give you that. Almost there, boy. Come on now. Hey, look! Over there! Where? You see that? I don't see nothing. Have yours, slow down. Jeez. Oh, I see that. I definitely see that. John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Let's see if he can hear us. Oh, there's John. Come on. Up there. Yeah. This ain't good. I mean, whatever did that to that horse, it's probably still around. Could you imagine like a Yeti being in these mountains? That'd be kind of cool and scary. It's coming from up ahead <laughs> somewhere. <laughs> I'm down for a Yeti fight. Go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. You gotta walk? I hate walking, I that bro. Shotgun from your horse. Who oh yeah. What's up ahead? You right? You right? You right? Oh. You getting that gun then? Down this way. Okay. Oh, your horse just. You know what? Not gonna even acknowledge it. Wow. Look at this. Ah, yes, I never got to finish the story. Like I said, uh. Come on, about. Oh, you know, fine, I won't finish the story. <laughs> you sure about this? Oh, he's definitely oh, sure. Well, come coming in, John. Okay. It's slippery. Be careful. Oh man, I'm starting to get cold. I don't know about you guys. Holy crap! Is it Neo the game? Neo, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Help me. Bruh. Bruh. Ooh, that's kind of scary. I'm not good with heights. I get vertigo. Oh, my stamina is being depleted. Drops down here. Watch yourself. Watch out here. What am I watching for? Like, if I fall off, that's it, bro. Watch your head here. Okay, from here. Watch your step. This is real slippery. My stamina is low, so. Is there anything that gives me stamina? Uh, let's eat some kidney beans. Stay close to the wall. Up here. Come on. Come on. Okay. Got your little. Victoria going on here. That sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. There we go. Damn, it's cold. You know what I'm saying, bro? Let's keep moving then. Come on. I'm behind you, Javier. Don't worry about Run! it. Marston, you hear me? John, can you hear me? John, you there? I'm here. That's where I left. The ledge. That's John. We're coming. Down here. Where? Over here! All Over right! There. Hot down, Marston! John? Ooh, John, you're not looking so That's good. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. Oh, you don't like seeing me? 
you don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. <clears throat> oh, I'm freezing. Don't worry, John. We'll be taking you back to the mining camp. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. <laughs> well, and thus I carry John Marson into the. Let's try this way. Uh, Ain't you a sorry sight? Into the snowstorm? Can't I was gonna say sunset, but that didn't work here. You there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You all right? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Damn. Uh oh. Look up there. It's the wolf pack. For the horses, I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. All right, John, come on. Come on. Let's get you on that horse. Let's get to this. What's up, Wolf? What's up? How you doing? <laughs> Bitch! Bitch! Gotta reload real quick. Hey, ready to go away. Oh, I, I hear the howling. Oh, I heard that howling. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I know, I know I messed up those three wolves with a shoddy, but is this not my horse? I gotta wait. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, horse. Relax, chill out. As I was saying, uh, I may have beaten those three wolves, but holy crap. Fighting a pack of wolves at night when you're not paying attention? It's not the best time. Not the best day. Come on, then. Let's get back to the others. Oh yeah, let's get the hell out of here, man. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a a dog bite. <laughs> yeah, a dog bite. You a fella? Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Yeah, but that dog probably had Not rabies. Yet. You probably just have a uh, an infection and maybe hyperthermia. Crap. Down the hill. Where? Gotta get that key. Mm. Gotta reload. Get the hell out of here! Get out! Where? I'm not even looking where I'm going. Holy sh! Look out on the right. We got oh more wolves. Oh my god! There's more wolves. Get out of here! Oh, I ran him over. It didn't even matter. You see any more, Arthur? Don't think so. I don't see crap Jesus. out here, man. You still with us, Marston? I don't see Jesus here either. You're gonna be okay. Well, some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now. We should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose the scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. Man, you know, we're gonna I gotta say this part here is pretty crafty and smart, dude. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Nah, you can do better than that. One thing you ain't short on is fantasy. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Home sweet home. Okay, after this, I'm definitely turning on my heater, dude. Oh my Come god, on. I'm freezing. Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here. Yes, help. Please turn on my heater. I'm freezing out here. And, and someone attend to John's wounds. Can we get some help? We need some help here! Come on, help him down. You're alive! You're alive! Come on, here we go. There we go. <gasps> Ay, <gasps> careful! Idiotas, it's his leg! Oh, come on, let's get you warm. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. 
Thank you. Chill, Abigail. The man got attacked by a pack of wolves in midst of two days. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west <laughs> with all is the where civilians? our problems are Come worse. On, man. Come on, Herr Strauss. I hate Let's get people. warm. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Morgan. You're welcome. Have a nice day. We have been running for weeks. Weeks. We found shelter and oh, it's just been a resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Arthur's writing? Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. I didn't take Arthur as a writing man. So New journal you events and change occasion you noted in your you check get it strong, out. We get warm and we wait. When the storm breaks, we move. But we're safe here. So this is the... Warm enough. I guess. Okay. We have been running for weeks. I mean, Sound running more doubtful. than usual. Not doubtful, just worried. We have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. I hope not. We had a bit of bad luck. But then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit, and we go back to Blackwater, and we get our money, or we get some more money, and we keep heading west. But we're heading east. For now. For now. We got this. We're safe. Yeah. For now. Stay strong, Jose. What's up? How you doing, Dutch? What about you, Arthur? You doubting me, too? Never. Good. Because you know me, son. I'm just getting started. <laughs> Once we get some money, well, they, that has me concerned, they dude. better send some good men after us because they ain't never going to find us. But we need money. Don't we Coach all need does. money? Thank you, sir. I need money. For your strength. The audience needs money. It means a lot to me. Especially with Christmas shopping. Yeah, by the way, I'm recording this on December. <laughs> Where you going, Dutch? Dutch. Okay. How about you, Hosea? You weren't there, Hosea. I'm aware of that. And they shouldn't have been either. Oh, well, we can't change nothing now. Can I sit with you? I guess I'm getting cozy with Hosea. Can I actually greet you some more? Anyway. Try not to worry. Okay, Arthur. All right, I guess that's it. All right, so one of the things I know about Red Dead Redemption 2 is like its story depth and character development and just the interactions. Like if you just sit around and listen, you get exposed to a lot of information and interesting dialogue. So yeah, I'm the type of person that wants to like search and scour every nook and cranny of the room. Nothing, of course. Hello? Who's this Molly? You okay in here, Molly? It might be warmer by the fire. I'm fine, thank you. Okay. Well, just hang in there. Just gonna try and stay warm. Oh, what is that? Oh. 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 Wait, that's just a cane. Basically, my uh, what I'm owing about, I see this little baby doll in his carriage in uh, that little horse thingy. Yeah, got me thinking that uh, the family that lived here, well, it was a family that lived there and had a child. And uh, let's hope that they left this place for a better place. What is this on the planet? Is this a book I can read? What am I? I can't read. Oh yeah, speaking of reading. Let's read this journal. Colter. We have been running for weeks. I mean running more than usual. The job they was pulling in Blackwater, robbing that ferry, it turned into a disaster. Young Jenny got killed. Poor thing. While Sean and Mac both got arrested or killed, nobody seemed sure. 
Good shot of girl. I'm not too sure if by accident or design. And it seems like it might have been a setup. Hmm. Okay, interesting. We took to the hills and in, 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 Ah! We took to it. Oh my god. English very hard for me. We took to the hills in an almighty scramble, leaving money and most of our things behind. Is there more to me? Just apparently not. Okay. Okay. Arthur's basically talking about what happened, and he kind of knows what's gone up, but he thinks it's a setup for what happened to Dutch shooting the girl. Is that a train? Just a ambulance? All of the spring I've been hoping for, Jose and I have been planning a robbery of our own in Blackwater, but I guess that's been abandoned along with most of what I own. I'm profoundly concerned as to what happens next, once we leave this place or the law finds us calling up here. Find a girl, well a woman I should say, her husband had been murdered by some calm or Driscoll boys. Nasty business, oh, that's Sadie. Oh really, that's it. Actually no, that starts his quest. Um. Okay! Wait, there's more talk going on? Is this? You're the one with the death wish. I am doing everything I can to keep these people alive. Pinkertons. Lots of them. And bounty hunters, too, more than ever before. And all after us, we were no set arguing. up in Blackwater. And none of them dumb enough to take that pass in winter or think us fool enough to do it neither. We got a few weeks. By the time they find out where we are, we'll be gone. Where to? I ain't got that yet. <laughs> But this ain't Wait, done. there's a third chair? Not no way. <laughs> that was interesting. I never witnessed that. I, I mean, for transparency, I played this game once, but I never beat it. I played it to like a quarter of the story. But anyway, that was an interesting you dialogue. Warn them about that Blackwater job. Yes, but who listens to me anymore? Oh, well, we'll work this out. Anything in here for me to take? No. Well, they seen uh, Hosea and Dutch seem to be having a quarrel. They don't agree what happened. But Dutch is doing the best that he can. Where did he go? Yo, Dutch! Be over there. Should we go talk to him? Honestly, guys, I'm actually really curious. I'm gonna explore. <laughs> I know, wasting time and quitting, but I don't give a damn. Hello, everybody. It's okay. It's okay. Oh. You're safe now. She'll be okay, Arthur. I'm sure she will, Mary Beth. Damn, I feel bad for Sadie. How you doing, Reverend? Miracles for us, Reverend. I wish I did. Yep. Keep warm. We need something. Keep warm. Okay, Mr. Strauss. We'll I think so. Here. Well done for finding so. Mr. Marston. Some days. good news at least. And we've had yep. tough times before. We keep moving and we keep together. Same as always. All of you. Ain't that so, Mr. Morgan? Of course. Okay. He that is so impoverished that he hath no oblation chooseth the tree that will not rot. Reading he a passage unto him a cunning workman to prepare. Is it he that sitteth upon the circle? Uh, of just like in real life, I don't know. I already don't care. How's it going, Abigail? Hey, how's he doing? <laughs> He's okay. He just needs some rest. Thank you again, Arthur. That's all right. Be warm. Yo, John. How you doing, buddy? <sighs> you doing okay now? Oh, I think so. Thank you. Of course. They shall not be planted. Yay, they shall not be sown. Good night, John. Their stock shall not take root. You're still reading the passage, huh? He shall also blow upon them, and they shall wither, and the whirlwind shall take them away as stubble. You been happier now, Jack? Will he be okay? Yeah, I think so. Just needs to rest. 
just need some thaw so we can get those wagons out. I know. We'll be okay. How you doing, Uncle? I'm okay. I've been, been through worse. Well, I just one time in the... Sorry, I, I can't right now. <laughs> the more I play, the more I relate to Arthur and like him. He just reminds me of myself. Hello, Key. You've done the best you can with this place, Miss Grimshaw. It could be worse, given the circumstances. No doubt. The creator of the ends of the earth. Ma'am, I'm real sorry about all of this. My husband, my house. Of his don't know what to say. What do you say in this situation? I'm sorry. Like, other than like, I give my condolences, but that just seems so damn shallow. And like, uh, what's it, what? I, what's the word I'm looking for? A typical response, basically, that offers no help or suggestions of anything. Well, try to stay strong. I don't care. <laughs> Arthur. Uh, at least you tried, Arthur. Gotta stay no. strong. You okay, Mary Beth? Just thinking of Jenny, Mac, Real Davey, Real Sean, Real and wondering who's what next. What on earth does it mean? We'll pull through. At least we got John back now. I don't know, now. Miss Karen. I realize now that I truly don't. That it brings me comfort. Hmm? Again, interesting dialogue going on here, and I know, I know, people are not gonna like. I don't know, I don't know. I'm keeping this in. I don't care. This is very interesting. Yes. Yo, Reverend, what you got? Anything else to say? Reverend. Hello. How are you doing? I just keep consulting the scriptures. It's interesting. He's a reverend, but he doesn't even believe or understand or uh, truly understand what he's saying. Karen? You okay there, Karen? Fine, but I would kill for a whiskey. You know what, Karen? You ain't wrong. You know what? I'm gonna end the video right here because I'm gonna get myself a shot of whiskey, turn on the heater, and forget about the cold. <laughs> so, if you like what you saw, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and like always, guys. I'll see you in the next episode.